I'm going to stop on that because for me, that is what the whole thing is about, uh, the quality of the trot. Uh, if you think the shoulder in, uh, its purpose is to act as a both a suppling and collecting exercise, uh, if it's written uh, correctly. Uh, and for me, one of the biggest things I look for is, first of all, I look at the quality of the horse's trot before it even begins the shoulder in. And the question, the biggest question I ask myself is, does that horse actually maintain the quality of its trot throughout the exercise from beginning to end? And then I start thinking, and has that shoulder in been presented in such a way that it's actually going to improve and develop the horse's collection. And for me, those are the main questions that I would ask myself as a judge. And if the yes uh, answer comes to those questions, then it's going to be on a high mark. Um, then I would look into more of the, the absolute details of uh, was it correctly uh, bent, showing a uniform bend from pole to tail, um, and was it soft and uh, submissive in that bending? Um, and I'm always looking for the, the feeling that the horse gives to the rider's inside leg and becomes lighter in its inside rein connection, if you like, um, so that then in a uniform bend and in the correct position, the quality and impulsion, especially of the trot, is maintained, uh, then the horse has actually no alternative but to step underneath its body weight with its inside hind leg, therefore developing its collection. And that's what it's all about.